Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to print from your phone on a HP printer that is not compatible with Apple AirPrint or something like that. So, say you're like me, you have a printer from, or I think this is from around 2011, so it's like right before AirPrint, but it still can, has like networking capabilities. So basically, if your printer can go online, which like mine can, you can see you've got all this here so if it can do that then you can you can do this so the first thing you do is go onto your mobile device and download the HP smart app which will be fresh from HP you already have it so let's download it and wait for that to install so really all you need is you like your printer to be set up and connected to your home Wi-Fi network like mine is and to make sure that your device is on the same network as it so yeah I'm pretty sure that's what you have to do so open the app and then it'll show the screen just say welcome to HP smart and just click continue you don't have to do notifications you don't have to do this share your data then it'll say searching for your printer X this out then it should say your printer. I don't see mine here though. So let's see what's going on with that. So if it's, it should right here pop up with your printer. But if we go into here, we can see that I might need to connect to this network because that's the network that this is on. Cause like, for example, I have a 2.4 gig and five gigahertz band of, in my Wi-Fi, so. I might have just needed the other one. Okay, so then if I do that and refresh it, will it work? I guess not for some reason. That's annoying. Well, if when it does work, which it should, you can just click OK there to allow access to your photos, and then you can just do that. Oh, here you go. Actually, okay, I did that all wrong. So actually click plus. Click OK, and then you should see your printer in this list. It auto popped up when I did it on my phone. So just click this, then click OK. And then there you go. There's your printer. It's that easy. It pops right up. It'll tell you your ink levels. It'll tell you whether it's ready or not. And then if you want to print something, just go to view and print. And then you can go through a few different articles. So look, I'm just going to do a random thing. Oh, uh, let's see. Let's get this, find something random to print, just so I can show you. Uh, okay, let's do this random Apple background. So you see this, you just tap this, and then down here you click print, and then you click print again. Make sure it changes to this, and then there you go. It starts to print on your printer. I hope this helped you guys out. I really appreciate you guys watching my videos. Please remember to comment, like, and subscribe for more. And I hope that I will see you guys in the next video. So you can stop watching now if you want, but if you guys want to see it print, then you can just keep watching now. This might take a little while since, again, this is a nine-year-old printer, so... Yeah, it's not going to do the best when it comes to speed. Yeah, it goes slow. As you can see, it prints it right out. Prints it very large too. And there you go. So I will see you guys in the next video.